Hey guys, it's Ty Bauer here, and yes, I am back. I tried my best. I've been busy, um, you know, finished something major, and I'm not sure when I'm going to get back to the part 5 of Spider-Man, or if I'm going to really do that at all, but I do know this. I'm going to tell you a non-spoiler version of Captain Marvel, and then... Next video, maybe in a couple days or so, um, I'll tell you the spoiler version. It'll be the best because, like, I waited way too long for the Venom version, and now I realize that that was a mistake. So I'm not gonna make that same mistake again. Anyway, um, yeah. So Captain Marvel, I rate it about maybe a five. I mean, I can try to explain it. Now, it wasn't, like, the worst movie i ever seen, but, I mean, technically, they could have gone better. They could have done better. Um, there were a couple scenes I didn't like so much, and there were others that I actually pretty enjoyed. Um, I thought it was a pretty okay film. Like, it was good for certain scenes, and uh, not so in other scenes. I'll get into more of that in the spoiler version, but basically what I have to say is, in all, if you're a huge Marvel fan and you really want to see all movies in order, I suggest you might want to see it, but if you just want to see it because how so so, so happened because it kind of takes place in the past and... You know, if you want to know how some of the things got started, it's not really worth watching. And if you're just there for the, like, post credit scene, it's not worth it. It's not really worth it at all to wait for just the post credit scenes. It's either watch it because you like Captain Marvel, which I'm not sure if it's com comic book accurate or, you know what I mean, like, good as the comic book or if it's better or if it's worse. It all depends on your opinion. But I do know this. If you try to, like, find out what happens in Endgame, it doesn't really say that much at all. Like, it doesn't say, oh, you're looking for answers for Avengers Endgame? Watch this movie. No, it doesn't really explain anything at all. I mean, it kind of explains who Captain Marvel would look like and what she sounds like and how she got the colors but other than that like there's not that much really to really say that was great and i for the record said for what i'm saying is if you just want to watch it to uh, find out what happens in avengers endgame then you're wasting your time that's all I can say. And But if you're just watching it just because of the actual character, then go ahead and watch it. Like I said, it's a 5 out of 10. Um, and that's it. Um, if you like the video, like it. Um, share this video with your friends and family. Hit the notifications bell so you get to see my face every day. And subscribe. Tiger Army out of here. Peace.